2000 Dodge Dakota 4.7, working great so far, some small side effects, understeer, but being able to smoke both tires makes it worth it. My 87 Dodge Ram 1502 WD stranded me on the boat ramp pulling my 18 feet cabin cruiser out of the water. Embarrassingly, I had to ask for someone to pull me up. I dropped the power tracks into the rear end in just a couple of hours with common tools. Then, for a true test, I decided to try launching and recovering my 27 foot pontoon at the same ramp. A freaking amazing. Just motored right up the wet ramp like it was nothing. Not bad at all to install. Short break in, now my truck doesn't get stuck in my own driveway. 02 Dakota 4.7 loves this locker. Should have done this 10 years ago. So much more traction off road even for 2WD. Highly recommended. Installation was simple and easy to understand for basic mechanic. 2002 Dodge Ram 1509.25 open differential 12 bolt rear and 3.55 gears if you have rear disc brakes. I recommend removing wheels and unbolting caliper. It makes moving the axle in and out easier to remove C clips and to uninstall spider gears and install locker sometimes noisy when engaging and disengaging but improves drivability and response. Maybe the single most cost effective off road performance modification you can make if your vehicle has an open rear diff. I have put power tracks no slip lockers and two different Dakotas I have owned. Just installed the second one. But ran the previous truck over 40,000 miles with the unit installed and had no performance durability issues. Only reason I did not give it 5 stars was because I felt the installation instructions would be better if they were in video format instead of line drawings. Easy to install. Works very well. Installed in 2005 Ram 1500 Quad Cab Saint Automatic with a 3.55 standard rear and 50k miles on 1. 2016.